Hey guys, welcome back to Dragon Melee. We are in Underworld Games in Nottingham and we're going to be playing some monocolored decks. Uh, well, I suppose monocolored, but also one sneaky colorless deck and a deck masquerading as a monocolored deck. <laughs> but I am playing Azuri, Renegade Leader today. Uh, so he is mono green, he is an elf, and it's an elf deck. So basically, what I want to do is make as many elves as I can, tokens, just get. A big big board um, and then just run over people with a load of elves so that's what i'm gonna do go ahead okay um so, sorry just camera am i looking at that one right? this one here yeah, yeah, yeah. so hello uh, i'm jonathan i am playing a deck that is no colors at all uh my commander is kozlek the great distortion who is very good at drawing me a lot of cards and turning them into counter spells uh when he's out on the field um, but the main purpose of this deck is to try and mana ramp, get out big honking Eldrazi creatures, and hope that I can maybe actually swing with one or two of them before they get blown breaks out. Cool. Uh, I'm Tom. I'm playing Setsu Bar, uh, one of the new new um, uh, directions. Uh, uh, I'm going to be proliferating uh, all sorts of counters. There's no real certain counter I'm proliferating, I'm doing a bit of everything. So I'm just trying to get a lot of value from counters. And uh, we'll see how it gets. Cool, sweet, sounds good. Hi, I'm Josh. I'm playing Mono Black Evelyn. Uh, the deck's plan is to put out a load of um, shapeshifter tokens and hopefully I'll steal some cards from other people. Cool, sounds good, right? Sweet. Jonathan, take it away. Okay, yeah. so just uh, just remind me, four of us, so drawing from... Drawing, drawing, drawing from the start. Yeah, yeah. Had, had, had a bit of a gap there, so a little bit rusty. <laughs> um, okay, so I will just start off with the wastes and pass there. Sweet. I'm going to push off the turn, I'm going to drop a forest, and I'll pass the turn. I'll draw. I'll play a swamp, and pass. Okay. Island nice. nice fairy magic. I will play an Ender Sands. Yep. Tap for two mana and put in a Mind Stone and pass. Three. Draw. Uh, forest. I'll just tap two and I'll cast a Nature's Lore. Search my library for a forest and I'll pass down. Draw. I'll play a swamp yeah. and pass. Uh, I'll play it in Ireland. I'll find it. Yeah. And then I'm going to tap two for a Tome of Legends. Uh, end battle with a page counter on it already. Uh, so I can tap it and draw a card. I'll pass it down. I will put in a Zoetic Cavern. I will tap for three mana. Put in a Basalt Monolith. Scary. Um, tap the Basalt Monolith for three mana. Put in a Chiron Toy. Okay. What does um, that do? The Chiron Toy basically um, one mana. I tap it, charge counter on it. Yeah. Um, I can tap it any time, remove all the charge counters from it, add that many plus one colorless mana to my mana pool. Okay. Cool. Sounds good. Um, like a so yeah. yeah. So I'm gonna. Tap for one mana, tap it, and put a charge counter on it. May I read it? Before you... Certainly. I don't suppose you proliferate my stuff as well. That I mean, nice. I could. Yeah, yeah, probably you could. You could if you wanted to, yeah. And I will pass that. Yep, cool. Untap, draw. Okay. Play with the forest. Elvish Warmaster. 2-2 two, two Elf Warrior. Whenever, whenever one or more other elves enter the battlefield under my control, I make a 1-1 green Elf Warrior creature token. Visibility trigger only once each turn. I can pay 7 mana, uh, and elves you control get plus 2 plus 2 and gain death touch to my turn. Classic Elf. He is a 2-2 two, two himself. I'll pass turn. Thank you. I'll untap and draw. <laughs> I'll play a swamp. And I'll play a Burnished Heart. Okay. Pass the turn. 
Job done. I did not draw a land. We'll hope we find a land off the top. Sweet. That is not a land. Five, six, seven, eight. <laughs> uh, I will end my turn. I will drop. <coughs> drop a card. Um, drop. This might be useful for a while. Uh, I'm going to drop um, Vivis Surgeon's Insight, which is draw free from the throat. Sure. Cool. Boy, Okay. That is unfortunate. So that is next I will put in a localized district. Yep. Um, I have lands that do various shenanigans because they don't need color, so if anyone wants to read, just feel free. Yep. Um, I will. Yeah. <coughs> yeah, let's tap for four. Put in a golden guardian. Whoa, whoa. I love that card. Um, and yeah, I'm going to tap for one, tap this to put another charge counter on it, and pass that. Okay, you've got a lot of mana. I'm not scary. <laughs> I got, I got two. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's your own fault. I have, I have two. I have two mana rocks. Mm. Spoilers. Because <laughs> he's free minded to play them. Oh, that's annoying. I'm, I'm, just, I'm just picturing River Song spoilers. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I'm going to tap four mana. I'm going to cast Bear Umbra. Okay. Ooh, yeah. That's an enchantment aura. Pretty good one. Creature gets plus two plus two whenever it attacks. I untap my lats. Uh, it's also got a totem armor. So if the creature will be destroyed, the enchantment is destroyed instead, essentially. Basically, what it says. Um, yeah, I think that's fine. Um, no, I'm actually going to attack Jonathan. For four mana. I want it for four mana. For four damage on attacks, my lands are on top. Okay. Um, yeah, I don't I don't really want to block with the Guardian, so cool. I'll uh, take the four damage. Four damage, cool. Second main. I am. So I'm going to play this. The only, the only human in the deck. Cool. But it fits the theme. Four mana for a druid of purification. Oh, I love that. So it's a two-three human druid. Many ETBs, starting with me. Each player may choose an artifact or enchantment I don't control. Destroy each permanent chosen this way. Now. A caveat. Groove of Purification says each player may. So you don't have to choose anything you don't want to. You can't choose anything that I control, but everything that does get chosen will all get destroyed. So I'm going to choose mm, the Basalt one left because that scares me the most. Are you going to choose the Are you, <laughs> are you going to ruin I have, that? I have a history of killing Joshua's Burnished Hearts. That is, uh, it is, uh, it is persistent. I could, I'm not I gonna, could fix yeah, it. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna, <laughs> you guys are gonna do that. We reached initial destruction, brother. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I'm not gonna do that. Um, I'm. Mm, As a long, long history of killing it. I I'm won't. Not, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna. I'm happy some, to just get rid of one, okay. one left. Yeah. Uh, I will blow something else up. Um, because I am so far behind, and you are not. Let's do the. Mm, this has two charge counters on it at the minute. Yeah. Yeah, this is just tap for one. Well, let's do, let's do the mana. Let's do the mana rock okay. 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 Um John has been sent back to the Stone Age. Yeah, you can choose as well. Let's see. You've got. I've got a burnished heart. Burnished heart. heart. Uh, you, you didn't blow anything of mine up, so I'll be nice. You did, however, so do I want to. Um. Nice one. Well. Free value. Yeah, but you, I, I don't know. I'm, I'm, think, I'm thinking I, I'm I might not going to be upset. Because of the whole, the whole mana screw thing. I'm not going to be upset if you kill it. Uh, do it. It's free. Go on. Let's let's blow it up. Okay. Cool. Yeah, I'm going to target you there at the beginning. <laughs> <laughs> that's, uh, that's a joke. 
He is a human, like I said, so he doesn't trigger my War Master, so I'll actually pass the And I will untap. Ooh. Draw. And I already dodged a bullet there. <laughs> I just need an island and I can play Manor Rock and then I can continue my game. Then you'll be flying. Yeah. Oh, this is the English version. Good. I will play a Myriad Landscape Tat. Mm -hmm. And. Oh, I could combat. Oh, I could spike Thomas. I'm going to swing for two at the <laughs> Thomas. I, I, I don't mind being hit right in that shot. Sure. Don't see damage, Thomas. Um, I'm going to pass a turn, but I'm going to. Should I do it now? Crack the burn shot. Yeah, sure. I just don't want to waste time at the end of your turn. Yeah. Yes. I'm not going to do anything else. All right. We have the magic three. I'll play a corner cut poke. Is it one or two? No pun intended. Two with a share of time. Two basics. No, no. Burn shot. Burn shot is just two basics. Two basics, I think. Battlefield tap. Yeah, 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 yeah. Guess what? A two swamps. Just a matter up for me. I will tap for four and put in a trading post. Nice. And I will pass there. I cannot swing the gar gah, golden guardian anyway yeah. if I wanted to. Oh, Tap the elves, I'm going over easy. Yeah, yeah they're not that. Do get to untap. Yeah, that's fine. Because I'm not driving more lands than this, so it looks like I'm just having four men for my game. Yeah, I'm full of lands. I've got so many lands. <laughs> i got more coming. Um, top of four mana, I will cast Immaculate Magistrate, uh, a 2 2 elf shaman. I can tap it to put a plus one counter on target creature for each elf I control. She will tar uh, trigger the elf four master, so I'll make a 1 1 elf four here. That's, is that a tap ability? To get this is a tap ability, okay. so I can't do that yet. Um, we should go to combat. I'm open. You are open. Oh, your brother is also open and he has not taken damage yet. <laughs> Josh, four mana. I keep taking four mana. Four damage. I will take it right to the face. And then I untap my mana. Nice. I mean, if you're going to draw from four mana, I'm sure you'd take that. Okay. Well. You can have four mana, it's great. <laughs> okay, untap. And. Tap the four mana again, and I will cast. Immoral Elfheim Elite. Okay. Legendary creature, Elf Warrior 3 3. When a moral Elfheim elite attacks, it gets plus X plus X until end of turn, where X is the number of other elves you can roll. You may have a moral assign its combat damage as though it weren't blocked. Oh, that's pretty cool. Okay, so you can block it, but it doesn't matter. It's, yeah. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. it's like pseudo trample. Right? It's the um, the legend from the King Knights bundle. Uh, oh, cool, cool, cool. And I shall pass the turn after that. The one thing I didn't have time to sort out in for this deck was my my land base. My entire land base is islands. <laughs> I don't have any. any oh, she don't have lands. I mean, I think I have like three or four lands that aren't mountain or forests, and the rest are in forests. Uh, I will untap the turn and draw. Hello. I mean, almost everything in here is non basic because I figure if I don't need colors anyway, then yeah. I don't mind uh, landscape right now. Numbers. So, I could do... Okay. That was silliness, but... I should just, you know, smash my commander down, but... I will cast... Top five. Let me just double read this to double check. I'm going to cast a Gauntlet of Power. I will choose black. Very nice. Yeah. You can crack your Myriad now. I can crack my Myriad now. I was trying to make sure I could do that before I played it. What does the Gauntlet do? Uh, every black. Mana I produce, I get an extra one. Yeah. It's basic, um, basic um, one. But it's it's everyone. But we're all yeah, monitoring everyone. Yes. So yeah. It also gives us black creatures plus one plus one. Uh, yeah, and that. But the only black creature in the deck is, well, one of the only black creatures in the deck is Evelyn. The rest of them is just. Oh, they're, totally, they're all just colorless. Yeah. Uh, okay. 
It's meant for the mana. Anyway, uh, I am done after that. Pass the turn. Very good. And tap, and I will draw. I'll crack my mirror at last week while we're uh, doing that. Okay. You will want to play. Like, whatever, not mana rock. Uh, we're going to play a glistening sphere. When it ATBs, it will proliferate. It does end without field tap, though. Yeah. ATBs tap, proliferate, and then you can have any color. If it has. Somebody has three poison characters? It yeah. Does tap for three minutes? Yeah, so it taps for, it's a normal mana rock, and then if somebody does have three poison counters, it turns into a Gilded Lotus. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. So I'm going to proliferate this. Yep. I have two mana, which I'm not really doing anything with, so I think that will be me. Yep. There you go. A little okay. bit of Dindra Alliance, so I did a bit of a slow start here. Just yeah. uh, had that problem last time. Okay. Um, I feel like I'm going to get some elf damage in <laughs> I mean, I'm open I and tapped, so I'm also going to get some elf damage. Start off by paying one, tapping this, paying one life, yep. creating a zero one white goat. Nice. Creature token. Do I have a goat creature token in this? Uh, interestingly drawn. Uh, no, unfortunately not. Would you like a little whiteboard? Please. I've stolen all your work was not you? Yeah, so I'm all of them. Oh, okay. But I need the little okay. one. Okay. I'll be your go. You can continue. Is it a zero one here? Yeah, zero, zero one. Um then Should I attempt to draw so yes. <laughs> can I have a little happy face? Tap Just two a little and let's put in Nice. Some lightning greaves, yep. and I may as well equip them to the guardian while it's there. Do you go, do you go so, have big tail? No, that's fine. No, yeah. it goes easy a small tail, I would say. He needs a little bit. Oh, a little bit. <laughs> 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 that's so silly. Thank you. Very nice. I like it. Um, and yes, unfortunately, I will pass there. Sorry, I wasn't paying attention. What's that? Lightning greaves. Okay, cool. I'll run up. And draw for turn. Thank you, Netherlands. Castle Garen Brig. ETB is tapped unless I control the forest, which I'm pretty sure I do. No way. Yeah. There you go. You need one of those, but blue. You're yeah. going to have so much mana. I'm not turn. Loads. I can't wait to cast an Eldrazi. <laughs> Four, five, six, seven, eight. So you've got 16 on the field. Currently, I've got three lands. <laughs> <laughs> One, two, three, four, five mana. I will cast Freyleith, Lanowar's Fury. Ah, she's a good one. She is a planeswalker. She comes in with three loyalty. Her plus two is to make a Lanowar elf, essentially. A 1 1 green elf druid creature token that taps to add green mana to my level. I can minus two to destroy an artifact or enchantment. I can minus six to draw a card for each green creature I control. Um, what I will do, so I'll plus two to five. And I will make a Lanor Elf. It's not actually Lanor Elf, but it's basically what it is. I thought yeah. you were gonna, gonna get me. <laughs> oh, okay. I can't wait oh, till okay. next turn. <laughs> um, so this enters, this is this enter, so I make yeah. another, yeah, another elf. elf Warrior. Okay. I will tap my Immaculate Magistrate. And I'm going to put one, two, three, four, five, six plus one plus one counters on Immarial. Cool. And then I shall move to combat. We will. I'm ready. <laughs> <laughs> you guys are just sitting there completely wide open. Oh, sorry. Sorry to hear this. Yeah, that's fine. Let me just. Yeah, let you guys do it. Oh, my phone on Do Not Disturb. I was dead, so, you know, I'll work that out later. Okay, uh, combat. I will attack Tom with the Elvis Warmaster, and I will attack Josh with Mario. And jump in your safe for now. How and is that? So, it is two dam or four damage from the Elvis Warmaster. 
In Mario, however, when she attacks, she gets plus X plus X to land turn where X is the number of other elves. So that's one, five. two, three, four, five. She also has six plus six. one plus one counters so on her. Twelve. So she's a she's a three three normally. Oh, so she's fourteen. So it's fourteen damage from a Mario. Oh. Yo, Ooh. my face hurts. Yeah. <laughs> I go to. I she deals combat damage through blockers as well, doesn't she? I mean, it didn't specifically say yeah. that your face was the target, just that you were. Yeah. yeah. Um, so actually, on attacks as well, of course, Elvish Swarm. Oh, the, yeah, the bear umber won't tap my lands. These elves are starting to scare me. How many cards have you got in hand? I have two cards in hand. Hopefully, they're not draw spells. <laughs> not yet. Because <clears throat> um, when that happens, we're in trouble. <laughs> <laughs> I'll use this now because I don't have anything else to do with it. Five mana, I'll cast Voice of the Woods. Which is a 2 2 elf. It says tap five untapped elves you control. Create a 7 7 green elemental creature token with trample. Okay, good that's... lord. Okay. <laughs> and that's all I'm going to do. I've got to do something about this board stone. <laughs> oh, oh. Uh, yeah, I was, just, I was just too slow at the gate to. Like, oh, man. Feel what's going on? <laughs> just elf ball doing elf ball things. I could do something silly, but it would also be. You're black, right? Yeah, it'll be very mean to you. <laughs> you not destroying my heart bags, are you? Uh, not me. Um, I'll untap for the turn. Let's see what. Let's see what. You're not you. you I'll, you'll see eventually in this game if I live. Uh, untap for the turn. Let's draw. Oh, I can't see. Land. Oh, Don't need more of this. Um, <laughs> terrible. It's your land. Yeah, one, two, three. Oh. Well, it doesn't really matter because you, you can just swing you straight. How, what, what life am I on? You're on 22. Well, I might just have to do it. Joshua, do you want me to track your left hip as well? I do feel very mean. I just, mean, just do it. I don't need to go I mean, there's like, I'm, it would I'm, make, I'm already behind, isn't it? It's like, it's not going to get better. I'm assuming it's a board wipe. It's an X spell. Oh, is it Torment? Yeah. Oh my god. That sounds familiar. Go right to Palefire. Basically, discard or sacrifice things if you can't use it. Yeah, them. it's a very mean spell. Uh, I usually use A number of times. I usually use it as a finisher, but I will die. And you got a buttload of things yeah. to like sacrifice. Or well, not sacrifice, to pay for it. Yeah, that, I just that wish it was a target player. Kill me. <laughs> yeah, because I, I can maybe do something about that, but it's also, it would be very mean to the two of you as well. How many how many Four tokens do you have? have? Three tokens. Yeah, three tokens. I think, I generally think you would, it would be worse off because we would, we yeah, would you not, could, wouldn't be able to help me. Yeah, we wouldn't do anything and then... Doing anything, yeah, I agree. But also, I can't block this thing. At all. Well, it, it got, deals damage through blockers and I've got 22 health and it did, did 14 damage to me. Right, well, <laughs> well, I mean, what about your commander? <laughs> well, she she fishes in your, your decks. Yeah, I mean, I'm sorry. I could. Good. There is a beast within I'm, you. I'm, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. If I agree, if you I, use I don't, that, I don't think we're done. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, don't, I don't think that's what I'm saying. I don't think it's a good idea to do right now. Unless you have enough mana that you could kill all. Can I of kill? Uh, how many? How much stuff have you got that you would have to select? So twice? permanence is it non-land or or, any, or just it's permanent? non-lands, I believe. Yeah, no, it's, 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 it's known to the table. It's, it's each uh, sacrifice of non-land permanent or discards a card. So I have one card in hand and I have mm. ten permanents. So you would take six times three if you do everything you can. I have eight. You've got eight. So you I would take, take six threes. I'd take eight. Yeah, so you'd take eighteen, not enough to kill Which you. Is no way, it's not even low. close. Uh, I will, yeah. Fair point. There's no point. Uh, I don't actually want it. I mean, uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Take out these two guys. Then, then you have to face down the house. Yeah, that's not. That, I don't, don't win against that. Even if you, I do put you back to the uh, turn three. Um, I'm thinking about. Okay, them. I'm gonna. Okay, I'm gonna cast a spell. How about that? So that's good. Eight mana for. Cast your commander. That's what I'm thinking. Yeah. I'm gonna pay eight. If you get a lap, I'm gonna be annoyed. <laughs> but I'm gonna cast a jump drive, jump diver. Sure. And eight. then I use the spare mana. Eight. Right. He costs three, and she costs five. Okay. So I'm just using mana efficiently, and cool. I'll cast my commander. So if everyone, okay, I'd better read it because it's a bit of a. 
Whenever Evelyn or another vampire enters the battlefield under my control, exile the top card of each player's library with a collection counter on it. Mm. Once each turn, I may play a card from the exile from exile with a collection counter on it. If it was exiled by an ability I controlled, sorry. Yeah, that makes sense. Um, yeah. I may spend mana of any colour to <sighs> cast spells. Oh no. Okay. <laughs> I just stole one of your lands. Oh, lands. what did you... It's a beast within. No! Hey, Damn! <laughs> what are the... Oh, How did you do that? Crazy. You literally called that out. So, reveal the top. Maybe. Sorry, zoned, zoned, zoned out there. Yeah. Yeah. Can, I can, can I read the other yeah. cards? Uh, I get to keep them. Yeah, so, so if I just make a little... I'm going to make like four little slots here. One for me, one Three. for you, one for you. you. Um, can I have your island, please? Yeah, you can't, so I'm just working out. Can you play islands? Oh, uh, Does it say you can play, play the cards? Play a card from exile. Yeah, I can you play. Can. Yeah. So yeah. I'm going to keep your 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 stuff here. Yeah. Okay, I've got a mimic back on my trigger. I mean, you've got pretty pretty good hits. I mean, I mean you can get rid of it tomorrow. Yeah, I can do that on your turn though. Yeah, okay, you can, you can, do, you can do so. You can do so once a turn. So you can do yeah. one on your turn, like score clamp. Hmm. I think or, I'm just gonna. Have you played a land? Or I've mimic played it? a. I've played a land. I might just make a mimic for that. Yeah. You don't really need a score clamp right now, okay. to be honest. Yeah. Um. Yeah. I'll pay four. Float one mana. Play mimic that. Yeah. I you have. might as well just use a floating to cast skull I can't, I can't do it once a turn. Ah, once a turn, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. So I've got six left available to me, and I will pass the turn. Okay, I'm not taking my only island. <laughs> Sorry. Ah, nice. Nice. Okay, we're running on gas. So it's six mana on the field. That means. Well, I think it's seven minor That's what I want to say. There's always one more you need to Okay. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to. <clears throat> I'm going to. Three, four. Three. Yeah, I'm going to do that. One, two, three. Uh, I'm going to play a uh, Archmage Ascension. Archmage Ascension read is an enchantment uh, that costs three mana. At the beginning of your end step, if you drew two or more cards during your turn, put a counter on it, quest counter on it. Yeah. If it has six quest counters on it, if I would draw a card, instead I can tutor a card from my library. Okay, that's crazy. So that's pretty good. Um, <clears throat> then we will tap three mana. I will pay two life. Uh, good to fit two. Yep. To uh, tether its gambit, I'm going to draw two cards. Yep. I'm going to proliferate. Oh, this was two. Oh, damn it. I could have done something. Uh, proliferate, um, draw two cards. End my turn and put a counter on this. Cool. Well, that's going to be good with the proliferate. Oh, yeah, proliferating, that's going to be nuts. Oh, dear. <laughs> yeah, it's like. <clears throat> Maybe you don't block my MR. Well, that's, that's, why I'm, that's why I'm holding. I'm going to wait till your turn and see you swing it, and then I'll work out if I'm going to use it. <laughs> uh, I mean, I do have something that I could. I could do, but it, it would it would be very very mean. <laughs> like not not just to to him, but to everyone. It's just a board wave, isn't it? Or is that all it does? It might be. Ooh. Oh, I don't mind that. That's great. Yeah, that, that, yeah. yeah all calling permanence. Every actually, yeah, to be fine. honest, everybody's probably fine except for me. Yeah, yeah. I'm okay with that. All his stuff is colorless. All his stuff is fine. Yeah, he he loses he loses his lands. No, the lands are colored. Oh, the lands are colored, yeah. Ah, oh, yeah. I always forget that one. Yeah. 
Because it would be insane if it just got rid of everybody. Yeah. <laughs> everybody is back to zero. That's, that's what I was thinking. I was thinking, isn't that a little bit, a little bit much? But, uh, no, I, I, I always seem to forget that about Lance. Do it. Yeah. I'm so down. Yeah, I'm ready for yeah, it. Yeah, that just wrecks just me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, I mean, considering this board state, I mean, I don't want to wait. Have you swing at me and him decide, oh, no, that's fine. Um, <laughs> that's fair. I so, mean, it's definitely. Uh, let's see. Um, can I do oh, yeah. this? Um, I think I can. Yeah. Okay. So, I'm gonna tap mine stone for one. Mm-hmm. Um, to tap trading post, sacrifice a creature. Sorry, goat. Um, and return an artifact from a graveyard to my hand. Yeah. Um. I mean, not not going to be able to do it this turn, though. Sadly, but that's okay. Um, then I will let me. Um, could I? Could I? If I. Hmm. Not quite, but I might be able to do some other shenanigans. Let's see. Um. Am I all right using my dice? Because I can't read these very well. Yeah, that's fair. Is that all right? Yeah, yeah. I thought I'd do that just so it doesn't look like I've got a load of random stuff. <laughs> <laughs> so tap for one, put in a voltaic key. Yeah. Um, Sorry, it's just I, I, I can't. I, the, the, the color of them is just too. Yeah, that's great. Um, so. Put in a basalt monolith. This seems scary. Um, Almost infinite amount. Uh, mm. yeah. When you could, you just need something to untap the key. Yeah. Yeah. So currently, I could get five mana. I believe, if my maths is correct. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um. Unfortunately, the cheapest thing in my hand is six. That's the downside to this deck. <laughs> so, uh, so yes, can't uh, can't swing with the guardian. So you just have to stand there and look golden. I have a question. Mm-hmm. Um, does this uh, does this have to target your own creature? Um, yes. Uh, I mean, I'm assuming from the text it, it specifically says fights another target creature you control. Okay. So. Because I was going to say because it's um, taps for two on the other side, so if you could like fight another creature. Yeah. Unfortunately, not. I uh, I need mm. to get something. Uh, but you can manage to eat it. Some, when you can something get else out. out. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so uh, so yes, I think that's that's me for now. Okay. I'm glad you got the skull clamp rather than the voltaic key. I have to say. Yeah. I mean, that's a good one for you. I'm tapping draw. Okay, that's actually pretty good for me. To be fair, score count's pretty good in this deck. I don't actually have it in here. Is it good in your deck? It makes a lot of 1 1 shapeshifters. Well, it makes a lot of 2 2 for the X's. 4 mana, I'm going to cast Harmonize. Okay, uh, three yeah. cards. Cool. One, that's two, a cool art. The fairest three. of. Mm. Fairest of fair. 4 mana, draw three. Great. And he untaps all his lands. Not fair. <laughs> <laughs> uh, tap one, tap the elf for two, and I'll cast a lightning greaves. <laughs> oh no. Ooh. Well, it costs one to equip, right? Zero to equip. I'm like, uh, uh, zero to equip. I can respond to the equip. You can respond to the equip. Yes. Yeah, okay. Um, You're good. Where I'll put these here for a second. And um, we will plus two Fraley's to seven. Remind me, does Fraley's have an alt? Yeah, the minus six is to draw a card for each green creature I control. Okay. Pretty good. So I shall That's make. That's really worrying because you know what? John, Jonathan's got. I said, so why didn't you minus it? Oh, I don't know what's going on in it. <laughs> so I make a Lenore Elf. That will trigger my War Master, so I'll make another Elf Warrior. The elves get bigger. <laughs> they grow. So it's corner of power. It's a big problem. Well. We've only got like a plus one, plus one to add a bit of money. But Josh can 
kill one of my elves. I can kill one of your elves. He likes. A very specific so one. So I'm inclined to not attack him. That'll be nice. Uh, Tom is completely open. Yeah, completely. I got nothing. Doesn't even have any mana open. There. Don't have anything. I'm not. Uh, I'm not a blue counter spell guy, and that's not what I do. <laughs> I think it's a good day for that. That reassures me a bit. <laughs> okay, so before I go to combat, I guess I might as well tap the Immaculate Magistrate to put a plus one counter on a creature for each elf I control. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So I'll put nine plus one plus one counters on my Warmaster. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Go to combat. Um, I will send Immoral at Jonathan, and I will send the Elvish Warmaster at Tom. How big is Warmaster? Warmaster is 4, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. 13. And how big, big is... Uh, so wait. when Immoral attacks, she gets plus X plus X to her, where X is the number of other elves I control, so she will get 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, plus 8. So she will become... Uh, 14, 15, 16, 17. Ah, lovely. And uh, she just will remind me what, what, how she works with blockers. So I can have her assign her combat damage as though she wasn't blocked. Okay. So if you do block with the, your dude, mm -hmm. it'll do four damage to her, but she won't do any damage to him because I'll just bypass that each in the face. So there's no point. Okay. Um, well then, yeah, I guess I take 17 <laughs> damage. Um, is this, is this the one that gives plus two, plus two, and... It has plus two, plus two from the totem armor. It's a two-two on its own, and then it has nine plus one, plus one counts. And is it the one that's making more elves? Your loves are on top as well. Not, they will be. Not, yeah. well, not yet. This one makes elves when I make when I make a token, or when, when an elf enters the battlefield, I make another elf, but okay. only once a turn. Okay. Cool. Uh, 13, you say? Yeah. Uh, Josh so wants to be a my friends. I guess I'm taking 13. Yeah. <laughs> I've got flowers, I'm sorry. Uh, I go to 29, I go to 19. And you said I was the scary one. And you have taken, let me just double check that that was correct. Did I? When, uh, when you were deciding about blowing up my artifacts, you decided I was scary. Oh, no, no, no. I decided that and I, I, I was so far behind, I can't have another person at this level. Okay. That's uh, a, yeah. <laughs> well, no, like, he was jealous of your mana. How's, how's that going for you? At least, at least <laughs> all you guys are relatively similar in life yeah. levels now. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> uh, Joshua, what are you at? He's still at 22. 22, yes. Yeah. Okay, so second main. I've got your life total here if you want to. Thank you. I'm going to... Lie. So I'm going to pay four mana, and I'm going to activate Castle Gambrig to give me six mana. Cool. Um, spend it only to uh, cast creatures or activate abilities of creatures. First one I'll do, I guess, is <coughs> Circle of Dreams Druid. So it is a 2-1 Elf Druid that I can tap it to add green mana for each creature I control. I'm currently running out of space. Let's get playing our card real quick. And the other three mana I will cast Elvish Harbinger. It's a 2 1 Elf Druid. When it ETBs, I can search my library for an Elf card, reveal it, shuffle my library, put that card on top of it, and then she also taps that no amount of any color. So I will go find an Elf, reveal it, put it on top. So, correct me if I'm wrong. Let me just see if this is what I want to do. Exiled Collection. It yeah. sounds like the name of a bad cover band. <laughs> <laughs> it's Evelyn's bad cover band. I feel that's pretty accurate. Yeah, okay. So, Elvish Harbinger says, search my library for an elf card. Elvish Promenade is a tribal sorcery elf. Classic. It is an elf card. Hell yeah. So I'll get this, shuffle my library, put it on top. Can I read it? Yep. I uh, I believe, although it's, it doesn't matter to me, I believe they've taken tribal out of the out of the rules now. But it's still an elf. It's yeah, still I know. A, now tri tribal is still a thing. I just don't think they just don't refer to it anymore because I think it confuses people. Yeah. Cool. So, oh Christ. Uh, yeah. So want... it makes it makes <laughs> more <laughs> elves. Make make a one one for each elf I can draw. Cool. But it's on top of my library, so I can't draw it right now. 
Uh, yeah, just leave it there for now and I'll put it on top of it. So, library shuffled. That is on top of my library. Uh, okay. I will equip the Greaves onto the Circle of Dreams route. You can make mana, right? It will give it haste. Uh, what can it do with haste? Tap, give him to add ten green mana. mana for each creature I can think of. <laughs> give him 10 oh, mana. Cool. <laughs> it's basically a uh, Gaius Cradle on a creature. How many cards have you got in hand? One. What um, activated abilities have you got on the field? Activated abilities? That use the green mana that you were going to make? Um, nothing. You can, he can buff his elves, right? I can right? buff my elves, but, but it's they've, already, second main phase. they've already done damage. I'm going to have to be okay with this. And pray that your one card in hand is not nuts. I'm like, you're going to get us killed. Yeah, we're going to die. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to I'm gonna, I'm gonna remind you, we know we know there's an Oblis Dust, and uh, he didn't draw for each elf. So, so yeah. bad's about to happen. I mean, it's the... I mean, second main phase. I can't do this yet. This needs to wait till next. Sec time. Yeah, second main phase. I feel like I can, I can tank that, that chance. Okay. Okay. So it equips. Yeah. Kidoki. Critters. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, critters. Doesn't matter. Yeah, yeah, no, yeah. Just be redundant right now. Yeah. So I will tap her to add ten mana. I think one, yeah. two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, you might have enough elf. mana anyway. Yeah. Finale. 12 mana. Uh, I'm just going to cast Azuri. Okay. Three of it. He has a mana sink, right? So I can pay one green mana to regenerate another elf, or I can pay five mana to, to give my elf creatures plus three plus three and trample as a mana turn. Okay. So the rest of that mana, mana will fizzle away. However, before the end of turn, I will then again attempt to remove the Greaves and attach it onto the Elvish Harbinger, who taps for one mana of any color. That's fine. And then I'll pass. I have... Effects? A very mechanically intensive happening that's about to happen. Okay. Well, so know. this might... I Because are you all tapped and there's no one got any mana? Uh, I, I have can one. get five mana if I need it. Okay. Okay, I'm just going to have to try and do it as best I can. Okay, I'm going to pay four and cast Beast Within yeah. on Evelyn. What? So you're going to Beast Within your Evelyn? I'm going to poof my Evelyn. Okay. When she dies, I get a 3-3 three, three Beast, and I'm going to put her under my Mimic Vat. Okay, uh, this goes to my graveyard. Yeah. Mm -hmm. She's now under my Mimic Vat. Yeah. So you can make token copies of Evelyn. Now I can make a token copy of Evelyn. Yeah. Yeah. What happens if the Mimic Vat goes away? You just lose your commander forever. Yes. This is the danger, <laughs> this is the danger zone right now. <laughs> We're in the danger zone because I've allowed her to be exiled right now. Yeah. Um, I will go to untap. Yep. I will untap. <laughs> Seems like a really bad idea. <laughs> no, yeah, you're, 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 it's the best of the bad no, ideas. You'll see, you'll see in a second. You'll see in a second. I have a plan. I have a plan. <laughs> I'm going to untap. In my upkeep. Maybe he has a card or something. No, no. It's on the battlefield. What I'm going to do. I mean, if he doesn't have a card, this really is a bad plan. Yeah. I'm going to pay three. Uh, I could do this actually in my main phase. Pretty sure I'm not. I don't know why you'd. Why, why would you do it in your upkeep? Just because I want to get her out from under there as fast as possible. Yeah, I'll go to I'll go to draw. Okay. Okay. This changes. I'm trying things. to think what he could possibly be up to. Uh, it's on the battlefield. I'm gonna pay pay three. It's on the battlefield. Tap and mimic that. Get an Evelyn. Uh, oh no! You're gonna get my Elvish Promenade. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want that on the battlefield. Um, this is, she's gonna. Exile. Yeah. Exile everyone's stuff. You get the Elvish Promenade. You get a Soul Ring. Oh, heck yeah. Oh yeah, more mana. More mana. <sighs> more oh, mana. I really could have done with that as well. Yeah, you really could have. Uh, I'll get a Soul Ring, okay. This goes here, <laughs> this is here. This is your beast. Oh, that's the beast, sorry. I've used your beast with it. Yeah. Okay. Do you want to put your paws on the right or something? It's a little bit confusing. I uh, let me just move all this over so it's actually got some space. Yeah. 
Okay, exile collection. I have one floating. Sorry. Oh, just, I have exile mine as just, well. Just for my sake. Yeah. Can you swap the exile and the creature so I can see the creatures and I don't need to see that so much? Okay. Uh, give me a sec. So it just it just makes it easier for me to see what's going on on your actual battlefield. Sorry, future editing. It's all right. Uh, this can go. Yeah. Yeah. I'm a problematic person. You know, um, the problem. arcane signet and the island are mine. Yeah, I know. I've got them in where you guys are. Oh, he, he also has an altar key. I was like, really? I do have an altar <laughs> key. Didn't get it from me. <laughs> do I have a altar key? No. I don't. Uh, give me your. Give me a pen. Yes, so. Eve. How often do you do this, by the way? Uh, every couple of months. Mm -hmm. I usually tend to get a good few games, so. And do I you really come every two weeks? <clears throat> do, you, do, you, do you go to different shops or is like. No, mainly, you... mainly here at Dibs. Oh, okay. Because I'm, I'm local to the area, so. Yeah, I noticed how you said nothing that you wouldn't. Local to the area. But <laughs> <laughs> okay. well, just so other people could think, yeah, that, yeah, that's where we are. So. Okay, so now, yeah, I've got all your stuff. I'm then going to use my once per turn cast of a collected item. Yeah, and I will cast this with my floating mana. Mm -hmm. I will then equip it to the junk diver using a mana. I will yeah. tap another one. Junk diver dies. Junk diver dies. Draw two cards. Uh, I draw two cards. I will choose to put the Junk Diver under Mimic Vat. Okay. Moving Evelyn back to the command zone. Sure. Ah. Yeah, that makes sense. Clever. You, you don't want to just choose to leave her exiled? No, I'm <laughs> I'm happy with her in the command zone. Uh, so, junk, so Junk Driver will die. Yeah. He'll go to the graveyard. I'll bring back Pretty this sure. from the graveyard using Junk Diver. Yeah, remember to say the name. Oh, I'll bring back Burnish Heart from the yep. graveyard. You draw your two cards. You've already got cards. enough lands. <laughs> One, <laughs> two. Okay. Maybe, maybe it's a blocker. You know. I thought it would be the green deck going land crazy. No, jo jo no, no this is whatever the deck Joshua plays, it's going to end up with 15 lands on the field. Yeah, yeah whatever deck. <laughs> so this is Tax with a Junk Diver under it. Actually, I'll put the Junk Diver actually under it. And I got no more uses of the collection counters this turn. Okay, I'll play a land for the turn. For our stronghold. Yeah. <laughs> Are you going off? Uh, you happy? No. <laughs> Let me read how much I can make. It seems to be a recurring thing this game. So it's three. Three tap. Uh, I've got one floating because I paid an odd number for the. Uh, so eighteen mana minus the, the power of So it adds one extra, I believe. So whenever you tap a basic, fifteen mana yeah. is it? Okay, so you tap a basic. You need to tap three swamps to activate the cabal, but you'll get Six. triple twice the mana from each swamp you tap. So I would get three in my floating, I'd have three to pump into this. Yeah, you get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine from Stronghold. Nine from Stronghold, and then another... So nine from Stronghold, three, so that's 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. I mean, can four. I, ki can oh, I wow, kill some people? I think you could, I mean, if, if you torment, you could probably definitely kill these two guys. You'd yeah. wipe my board. I would totally wipe you, and you've only got one card in hand. One card in hand, um, which is not going to be much help to me. How much life are you still on? I'm still on 40, no one's hit me yet. That'd be a really boring game after that, because I don't have a lot of power on board. I would spend a while rebuilding. Yeah. Um... I mean, what I could do as well, depending on how big the torment is, I could just take all the damage if I could and then yeah. keep my board. You only need to survive and then you'll kill him next turn because we're dead. <laughs> yeah. I mean, if, I, if I can make an argument for keeping myself alive, um, <laughs> the uh, that exile take cast yeah. shenanigans, you could get some pretty big Eldrazi from here. That is fair. Yeah. You get to see I'm gonna, Eldrazi. I'm going to try doing that then. Okay, so there's two cards in this 
in my in my hand, I'm going to be casting. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to start with a birthing bells. I've got one floating from uh, equipping this yep. once, and I'll pay two to make it three to cast the birthing bells. Yep. Uh, and I can pay four, tap it, create a two-two colorless shapeshifter creature token with changeling. Yep. So I can tap this to make a vampire, vampire mm -hmm. for to trigger Evelyn. Do you currently have an Evelyn on the battlefield? I have an Evelyn on the battlefield. I've got the token totally Evelyn be, yeah. right. that, that disappears at the end of the turn. Right. Um, it's funny how missing one land drop makes you feel like like you look at all the other boards and it's like yeah. Well to be fair, I missed two land drops, I just have a lot of rampart in yeah. here. Yeah, it's true. I only have four five lands, but my creatures are also giving me a lot of mana. And also the ability to get them back from the graveyard when someone blows them up. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you very much for that. <laughs> I am gonna pay three. You mean six. Oh, yeah, good point. I'm gonna pay Pay, two. Paying for it is six, right? Yeah, but I'm going to make four mana. Yeah, okay. Tap my Cabal Coffers. Have one floating. Gain one, two, three. Oh, sorry. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So I've got ten mana in my pool. Yeah. Yep. I'm going to pay five. I have five mana in my pool to cast a Riptide Replicator. As a Riptide Replicator, Replicator comes into play, choose a color and a creature type. I'm going to choose black and vampire. Riptide, Re Re Riptide Replicator comes into play five with... five times fast. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Riptide Replicator comes into play with X charge counters on it. It's going to be one. Four and tap. Put an X X creature token at the, of the chosen color and type into play where X is the number of charge counters on. Yeah. Uh, red pie, red pie. So it's one. So you can pay four to make a one-one vampire. Yes. But yep. the, the, the reason I didn't make it bigger was because I want to skill clamp those if I need to. Yeah, that makes sense. I mean, yeah, it seems fine. It, yeah. So five in my mana pool remaining. Makes sense anyway. I will make some vampires. Question mark. I'm gonna make an Evelyn. I'm gonna cast. Mummy, you've already got one. So, I know it, I know, but this goes away at the end of the turn. Right. Move but, that. And that's got flash. Yeah, but I want to use the mana I've got in my pool. Oh. Right. So I'm going to cast Evelyn. Legendary rule gets rid of this one. Mm -hmm. Do they both trigger? So I get two she of your sees, cards? She yeah, sees this one she sees, Yeah, she does. Did she pay the, the commander tax for this one? Uh, yeah, I had five left in my pool and I paid two extra. Okay, so cool. Because yeah, they have to both be there at the same time for the legendary rule to trigger. Yeah, so they, so they trigger each other. They do trigger it. Yeah, they so will. Two. So you get two of them because when Evelyn enters and then when she sees a vampire enter. So she's. Yeah, she sorry. That one, that one, that one. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. So, so, you get two so I get two triggers. So exile top two. Yeah, exile top two. Oh, so you got you one of my two. One. <coughs> you a got spring Jack Pasture. Two lands for me. Okay. This isn't great. You got one of my count spells. Cool. Uh, oh, I do, oh dear. <laughs> what did I get? Land in a Vineril's disc. Oh, heck yeah. <laughs> I like your deck. You've already cast something from this pool. This I've already thing. cast it this turn. Yeah. The, the thing is, like, because he makes so much money, you can play everything out of this deck. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, I got, it just wasn't like a... Yeah, that's that's the problem. Something crazy. Like. I got a Clark Khan Ironworks and a uh, oh, Marionette Master. Oh, and of course, God. my board wipes are no good against cards from my own deck. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so I'm going to make my 4-4 four, four dude from the... Oh no, I can save that till someone else's turn. Yeah, so she's gone. I'm going to put this over here. You're about done? <clears throat> I... I'm happy. I mean, you, 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 you did a lot. I did a lot. I also have one creature on the battlefield. <laughs> Two creatures on the battlefield. I mean, you can make creatures whenever you want. Yeah, yeah, quite true. Yeah. Um... That will be my turn. Wow. <laughs> Pretty cool. This is the first time this deck's actually popped off like that. And See, now, now I'm thinking if I cast all this dust on my turn to get rid of this, this is going to be an even bigger problem. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I'm just going to be well, stealing uh, your Evelyn, cards. Evelyn is coloured, the vampires from this are coloured. Nothing What's else. What's this? That's a junk diver. It's, a, oh, that's cool. it's under the mimic bag right now. Yeah, oh, it takes right. out on the field. So right now, I might actually be better off leaving the elves alive. 
Yeah, he might murder me. I made a target on my back a little bit. I wouldn't say it's on your back, it's more like it's on your it's face. Just, yeah, it's great. <laughs> like, it's all over here. You have four mana, correct? I have four mana available to me. Okay. So you can disallow as well, by the way. I do have a disallow in one of these piles. Uh, is that just a straight up counter spell or that is, is counter target activate ability or spell? Counter spell plus you can do activate ability. Activated or triggered ability. Or triggered, yeah. Interesting. It's like the best. Like or yeah. catch all. Um anyway. Let's have a little look. None of this deals with bolts. All of it is blue. <laughs> okay. I feel like there's no. I feel like if I play my commander and he just gets all this dust, it's so bad. But I want to play my commander anyway. I mean, at this point, I'm really not sure casting all his dust is going to be the best move. I'm gonna. I um, mean, if he kills me, he's gonna kill you two on the next swing. I'm gonna play my commander. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yes, so, but then I could wait until he's killed you and then cast all his dust. Uh, tech you. Yeah. Tech you fault. I don't know. Fuck. Yeah. Uh, if, if it's got flying, it's a 3-5, and if you would pr proliferate, you proliferate twice. Uh, and then it's got the ability 1 and then 2 Phyrexian blue mana. Uh, remove 3 counters from other artifacts, creatures, and planeswalkers you control. Put an indestructible counter on on him. Yep. Um, Pretty cool. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Uh, then we will... Tap. Tap. This doesn't cost me any life to tap. That's the other one, right? Totally so. Uh, yeah, no, that's the, the other... The, the staff, whatever mm. it's called. Uh, I'm going to play uh, Contentious Plans. I'm going to draw a card and proliferate. it costs life space. to tap dibs. Sorry? It costs life to tap dibs. Tap dibs. I, w I was making a joke about the fact he used the word staff. Sorry, it was a very bad one. Oh, staff. Oh, I staff, get it. Right. Oh, okay. Do you want to proliferate my frailies? Do you want to um, proliferate my charge count? Actually, you could proliferate him and ruin my. I mean, to be fair, though, if you tried to go out there and tap dibs, you probably would be playing with life. So. Yeah. Okay. Did I just mess that up? Is this supposed to be on five? Or what was it on before? It was on three. It was on it three. Was on three, so I put it over twice. So it's always close to five. Right, yeah. on six. Um, which is actually a little bit annoying. <laughs> um, it's always that one mana short, isn't it? Yeah, it's always that one mana <laughs> short. Uh, let's see. So we could. We've got six. We've got six. You cost two cost five. I might do that and then just start, start cycling a little bit. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I will tap this for five five blue. Mm -hmm. And I will play a Teferi Master of Time. Ooh, that's pretty cool. He is pretty cool. He comes on three counters. I can uh, and he 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 can activate his loyalty abilities at flash Any speed time. in each of your turns as well. Uh, so he comes in with three. I can draw with a plus one to draw a card and discard a card. I can minus three to target creature you don't control phases out. Um, don't control phases out. Oh, yeah. I thought it was me control, so I was never mind. Whatever. Anyway, <laughs> uh, and then I can minus 10 to take two extra turns. Yeah, that's pretty spicy. Um, this isn't a take an extra turn deck, but if I you did. get there, you might as well. Yeah, it's like... Uh, so that, I'll go to four, I'll draw and discard. Fair there, everybody's okay. presenting themselves as a problem. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I feel like I'd just die if, like, at any point that you guys decide that you want to kill me. <laughs> uh, I'm, gonna, I'm, gonna, I'm dropping a card, I'm going to drop... Um, I want you. Yeah, we'll drop you. Uh, I'm going to drop a uh, Cura's uh, Dam Breaker, which is an ETB six mana card, which proliferates. Sure. 
Uh, so I do actually have two mana left. Can I do anything with two mana? No. No. You also have a lamp tap. Yeah. Were you including that in the turn? Yeah, I was including that, yeah. I will pass the turn. This will trigger. This puts a counter on it. Because I drew an extra turn card this turn. Because the four. If you proliferate, you proliferate twice. This isn't proliferate. This oh, is it's it's just put a counter. This is another team. Okay, if five. I drew two cards this turn, this game, oh. this turn, which I did with Contentious yeah. Plan. Very nice. I'll pass the turn. Okay. Good lord. I don't know if I get back to my turn, though. I don't think I get back to my turn. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if the Arl of Dust comes down, I don't know what's going to happen. Still I'm going to be, the... I'm going to be gone. Still debating about what to be honest. Um, I will be left with a pair of boots. That's all that will be left up. I yeah. feel. I think if you don't, at least one me will be dead next turn. <laughs> If you yeah, do. He, he could swing at you and me. Yeah. This, this is what worries me. Does got he's got his commander out as well? Does um, all does say each player sacrifices? Yes. All colored permanents yeah. they control, sacrifice. so I can't regenerate yeah. anyway. Good point. Yeah. Mm. Risk reward. <laughs> yeah. oh. it, I think it would make sense if you had a bit more creatures and stuff like that because you could do it and then mm. you can swing out and smash us. Mm. Problem is, if I don't, you're going to die. Yeah. I think you might die next turn. I think yeah. we're all going to die next I turn. I think the, like you, you could very easily deal with me, but. You guys have a lot of yeah. colorless I, stuff. I believe if it gets back to Joshua's turn, and then he wins with Torment. Like, I don't yeah, think. I don't think that's true. like. No. Especially if you. So if you. If you, if you all is dust, and yeah. he gets back to my turn, and I torment, everyone is dead. Yeah. Yeah. That's guaranteed. Yeah. That's the thing. That's guaranteed. Yeah, because I have nothing to sack, and I only have one card in hand. So. Oh, so you could freelease the gauntlet, which would help. That would mitigate a lot. That's true. But that depends whether or not my board is still here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Thing, no, I think if I cast all his dust and it gets back to his turn, torment will kill that's, everyone. That's that's it anyway. So I I think yes. I'm probably best not to. If it gets to my and, turn, I can probably make a pretty good go at killing all three of you. Yeah, yeah. But I think it's torment. Who, do you want to die to? Okay. Do you want to die to elves? Do you want to die to torrents? Yeah, I mean, I mean, <laughs> I, 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 oh, 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 I got, I got an idea. How much life you got? Uh, what? I got an idea. He's at twenty-two. Oh, twenty-two. You're at 22. Um, what's your biggest creature? The one that does the most damage. This is one, one currently, but this gets big on combat. Uh, what, how, what, what singular creature is like um, does deals the most damage? Yeah. So this is four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. This at the minute is a nine, but when it attacks, it'll get plus five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Assuming you haven't got any else. Assuming you don't get more else. If I don't have anything else, one creature. If if I just have this, it'll just be a nine. And this is a thirteen on its own. Thirteen, you're a twenty-two. Yeah. Mm Mm-hmm. I couldn't all these dust and swing at him with a big Eldrazi. It's one or the other. Uh, can I help you anyway? Uh, I love how this this is basically us trying to work out if we can survive another can, another uh, turn. You know, this is where is you there think. any way you can do the other nine damage to him? Oh, I just thought of a great play that you could do. Oh, what's how how big is this? Three three, uh-huh. and it costs four mana to to do. Can I read your commander? To, is that all right? Uh, yeah, it's. Uh, is it the one that, the newer one? Oh, it's, uh, I think it was the new the, one. Um, I mean, it's it's basically, yeah. you know, I would have a handful of counter spells. Well, that's the thing. May Could you it? counter my Torment of Hailfire? Uh, wh- how how exactly does Torment? No, of yeah, because it's going to be X is twenty two. Then there's no. Is it not? Is it, may, is it not counting? Yeah, just two. It. it just counts the X's. It does count the X. Oh, okay, never mind. Um, I thought it might. Yes, yeah, so no, I'd, I'd have to have a card with what twenty-two CMC. Yeah, to, I thought it might just need you might just need a two because that can spell that. It's convert. It's um, a little more flat. So no, I can't. 
I can't cast all his dust and deal damage to him. Mm. I don't think you need... Mm, yeah, that's a good point. Oh, but the thing's off the top of your deck, so you don't draw a useless card, so maybe you can buff it some way. I don't know. I don't know. If you want me to do that, I can. that's, that's an option, but it's fairly to, good. Yeah, to be honest, I think... For us surviving, that's probably like I don't think any of them have great odds, but I think that's the best of yeah. of, of what of what we have open to us. Okay. Um, um, yeah, I'll do that if you cast all of this. Okay, so let's um, basalt monolith for three. You're gonna kill me. What are you looking at me like that for? <laughs> two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah. All is dust. I will respond. I will exile uh, your choice of biggest creature. This one, 13. Yeah, I'll that choose one, okay. him. So he phases out. And then everything else gets sacrificed. And we sacrifice stuff. My poor commander, you lasted yeah. a turn. That's point yeah. I think that was the right move. That's my, but I mean. I think I just lose these two. Wait, so, okay, before we, before, sorry. Can I use her collection while she's not on the board? Her I don't think I can. No, you can't. What, is, what, what did she say? Because it's, it's her that gives you the ability to cast one each yeah. turn, isn't it? Yeah, you can't. It depends, sometimes it does work the other way. Once each turn you may play, because it's that ability that gives it, right? Yeah, so it's her that gives you the ability. Let me just see if I've got any good stuff. In here. I know I've got the disallow, but I don't want to disallow the others because that might save me if you don't burn me. Mm, no, I can't. Okay, that's fine. That's gone. And your beast is gone? Yeah, beast is gone. Thank you for that one. Now oh. everyone's gone. You could have disallowed the turret to the fairy dragon. Oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> <laughs> cool. Everything's clean. Um. Clean is clean is clean is a word. I still, Joshua still looks like. I mean, I'm just going to be yeah. stealing some cards off of your libraries, guys. No, you're not. You're going to torment us and kill us. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. that's the problem. I don't need to torment you. We kind of need to get rid of the gauntlet. It's the next, the next. I will pass that. Okay, so and I'll untap. This guy will face back in. And it's here. Let's see what happens now. Draw this. Not helpful. That's not what we want to hear. I mean, I could have killed him if I had my board. <laughs> yeah. Yes, but then you could have killed all of us if you exactly. had your board, which was that the was problem. That was the plan. <laughs> okay. Um, I mean, this gave me and Jonathan the best. Yeah. Best the chance. best chances. Yeah. Like, screw, screw you guys. <laughs> <laughs> How many blockers do you have, Josh? Uh, I can make one. You can make one. You guys, you have one. None. You don't have any. I could make a goat as well. You can make a for goat. For whatever good that would do. Okay. Azuri costs me five. Six. Is this the one that um, doesn't assign combat damage? No, that one's gone. Okay. Good. Oh, that's less. That's less good. Yeah, it's good. Does okay. this one have trample? This one does not have trample, though. It does not tap your lands and stuff. Sorry, it doesn't what, tap what's this? Lightning Grease. Lightning oh, Grease, okay. I've not seen that one before. Okay. It looks like we're dying to dawn. <laughs> I can kill Josh. Whoa, oh, really? Yeah. Uh, rude. But then I'm left to deal with you guys. Yeah. You know what? Can we make it? Are we allowed to make deals? We can, but I don't know. How I don't know how you. <laughs> you're gonna just torment you, you kill them everyone. It's not well, <laughs> unless you did a small enough torment that it wouldn't kill me. That's what I was thinking. But do you even have like the most permanents now? I, what I'm thinking. But then is, if you did that, he'd just kill you next time. Yeah, it's Jonathan tough. has way more permanent permanents now, right? True, but my life's on forty. Ah, mm. you can tank a lot of damage then. I mean. I sh I could just not use Torment. I'm happy to keep just whirring on your stuff if you don't kill me. The problem is, like, that's you literally have the game next turn if you cast it. Mm. Unless I have a. 
Uno blue cat one smell in hand. Smell. I don't believe you. I don't. <laughs> 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 I wouldn't have no, been trying yeah. to work this out so I, hard yeah. if I did. <laughs> to be honest, I think you do probably do have to kill me. It just kind of sucks. For me. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I will accept my fate. It's kind of annoying the way I have to do it because I was saving this for everyone. Um, See us too. We're great. We're happy. Wait, I can make it too. too Trying for the horse. <laughs> oh, 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 can I read it? Yeah. Okay. Turn on a turn, my creatures get plus one, plus one, trample and infinite. Okay. Okay. Correct decision. <laughs> How big is your guy? It's um, gonna be 14. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 with the infected. Oh, I should have pumped more into this. I might have been able to block. No, oh, okay. that's, a, that's a decision. Like, you made the correct decision at the time. Yeah, I know. But... I'll go to combat. I'll swing at you, Josh. 14 trample infect. Oh, my. Oh, has he got saying? I'll make a 2 2. I'll block. Doesn't, doesn't help. <laughs> I die. You take 12. Oh. Yeah. Uh, uh. <laughs> Gee, it's, it's, it's more pride thing. He wants to know he's done everything he yeah. could in his desperate last yeah. round. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Good game, guys. Right, That's second. rough. I untap in my second main. Well, untap when he attacks, I guess. I'm gonna start um, sweeping this up. Tap five mana to cast Azuri. Mm. Yeah, it's probably fine. Uh, I will attempt to put the Greaves onto Azuri. No effect. Cool. If um, I don't have Cosleg, yeah, I can count spell anything. That's all I got. I am Hellbent. Last turn. Okay, cool. Could you tell me yeah. what, just these a little all bit remain about exiled? They're all exiled, yes. Could you tell me a little bit about uh, your board? These remain exiled. Okay. My board? Uh, yeah, I'm just going to get both yours. Uh, where just, where yeah. am I putting exile cards anywhere particular? Uh, I just put just... them sideways under, under my graveyard. Okay, that works. Uh, on my board is a 1313 Elvish Warmaster. Actually, to be honest, when I make when I did that, I make a 1-1. So I have a 1-1. I have a 1313 13, 13, um, Elvish Warmaster with the Bear Umbra on him. And then Azuri, who is a 2-2. Uh, with the lightning graves. graves. And what have you got? You've got this guy with lightning graves, you've got yeah. a basalt monolith, a volcanic key, uh, trading post. Trading post. Feel free to read, that can do a few things. Yeah, I know. Uh, mind stone and this stuff, I mean, like. I, do, I know what your land is. Yeah. All good. Thank you. Sorry, it's just uh, All good. catch up. I remember. There's a lot to keep track of in a, in a magic game. So close. Ooh, I got a good draw. Torment is scary. Yes, you should enough. never have told us that you had it. I mean, it was, I, it's not, in my opinion, it's not like a fun way to win. It's crazy. Yeah, that's why it's I don't crazy. like using it. It is, like, it is just I, like. I mean, I, it's a win con just as much as anything else is. Yeah. But I mean, there's win cons that are too easy. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> too I, did, easy. Um, I, I did a commander uh, tournament once and, um, and I put a, like under sort of what would give you and take away points. Um, you know, like um, you know, you'd you you know, you'd lose some points to uh, like hitting the player with the lowest life instead of mm. you know hitting up stuff like that. Uh, winning with approach the second sun was minus a hundred. Yeah, <laughs> I which mean, would put you instantly in last place. I put torment and approach in my decks just because I don't like games going on longer than like an hour, an hour and a yeah. half, and I just want a way to just end it, end it. I don't mind dying if I've got it open on the next. No, I like something. long games. I have decks that want long games. Yeah. Hmm. Okay, I think this turn I could. I think I want to do that. I think I want to do that. Uh, I'm going to play a Mind Flayer. Yep. I'm going to take control of your big guy with the Totem Armor. Sure. Ooh. Thank you. Um, that makes me feel nice and safe inside. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's all I'm going to do. I'm going to chill. Sure. Okay. okay. Alright. Um, right, so you've got 40 life, but you've just got done 19, a scary elf. 19. You're still at 40. Um, God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> no one's attacking me. <laughs> Alright, so let's see. One, two, three, four. 
six lands on field. How many? One, two, three, four, five, six, but potentially seven mana if I'm using it for a creature. Okay. Um, I don't think it particularly matters who I target. Uh, I, can't, I can't do both of them, can I? I've got a decent amount of mana. Yeah. You've got five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten mana. Yeah. I'm going to... I don't know if we're a cousin, I think. Um, um, can we read this? Just to make sure. Yeah. Um, make sure you don't get murdered immediately. It doesn't have a light annihilator, at least. Oh, yeah. Uh, it's one of the good... The good at all, right? That's... Good. Three... Fair. You just want to untap it. It's two... Three, four, five, six. Yep. For Oblivion Sower. Mm -hmm. um, cool. I will target Forest or Islands. I've literally only got Islands, by the way. Yeah. I pretty much only have Forest besides Castle Gambrig. Uh, I mean, you both got the same lands on the field, so um, I'm just wondering if, if either of your if either of your decks is likely to have more lands than the other, give, give me more chance of hitting them. I think. I know exactly how many lands are in my deck. Yes, but I don't. <laughs> I'm, th I'm thinking g green is more likely to be a little bit. Although, if you've got if you've got land spells in there, you might have less actual lands. A lot of my ramping is with my creatures. Yeah, so that's that's a bit risky because if you've just taken out a bunch of lands to put rampy creatures in, so yeah, I think target, targeting you would be more of a coin toss. So. I think let's target you. Yeah, I think so. Oh, hello. Glad to be your library. As for Toad Island, um, this is fun. Uh, mm, the rock. Um, oh, hang on. I've just realised something. There's uh, no. So no, you, you. Oh, you get the you get the lands from the exile. From did the did you exile any lands from anyone? One of his blues. So I can Maybe play any la any number of lands you own from exile. Oh. On the battlefield yeah. under my control. I do have two lands in exile. Yeah. yeah I think it's target. I believe it's target. Uh, yeah, so, oh, so that's what me. I mean. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so these are all like. If I thought about that first, I might yeah. just him instead. Yeah. But, so, I, I, I forgot will. about that as well. Um, so, yep, I have two islands. That's pretty foil. Um, <laughs> yeah, I run out. <laughs> I will. Um, Let's see. I could put haste and swing in with. Uh, I'm just trying to work out. So you've got a two, two, and a one, one. Yep. Currently, so I could fight this and swing, and he would still survive, I suppose. Um, can yeah. I do this? Yeah, I think I can. You can do that. Yeah. So let's um, let's tap for two. Yeah. I'll get Golden Guardian to fight Oblivion Sower. Sure. Um, Oblivion Sail will take four damage, Golden Guardian will die, Lightning Greaves will pop off. Just, yep. Of a Golden Corpse. Go, yes, they are indeed. And then I have a Gold Forge Garrison. That's fancy land. Tap for two, and you can make Golems, I believe. Four falls without a Thunder. Yep. Um. And let's see, so that taps for two, that taps for one. I could tap this for another three. Um, oh no, yeah, yeah, I could. Uh, just, uh, I wouldn't be able to untap it again, but. Um, yeah, let's, before combat, let's, uh, Do that, or do I make a guardian? Go golem. Uh, um, I think I, I could do with having another creature out. So let's tap for four, tap this, and let's make a golem. Mm -hmm. And I will then. Any cards in hand? Nope. Okay. No I, will, uh, I will then swing. Uh, Swing your way with with Oblivion Sour because you're you're on too much life still. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, any trample really? Uh, no trample. It's coming at you for five. It's currently got four sure. life. Uh, I will block with my Elf Warrior. 
before damage, I'll pay one and regenerate him. Okay. So um, Sarah, he's pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's that, that's fair. Um, yep, yeah, and um, I don't have any man left training post, so I will pass there. Okay. Turn. Probably draw a land. Not a land. Okay, that's better than expected. I believe in you. Five mana for Garuk, Primal Ooh. Hunter. What's that one do? Um, so I can plus one him to make a 3-3 three, three beast. I can minus three to draw a card equal to the greatest power among creatures I control, or minus six to create a 6-6 six, six green worm creature token for each land I control. And However, I, I will respond. Sure, yeah, it's on stack. When he's on the stack, I'm going to end your turn. Okay, this will go to the bin. And my turn is done. I what that. did you just cast? Uh, discontinuity. Discontinuity. Mm. I've never seen this before. Shenanigans, maybe I swung the wrong way. Sure. <laughs> I am completely out of gas. I have no card in hand. Two very small creatures. <laughs> I'm Island for the turn. Um, five mana. I'm going to play a, a deep close gate. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, this goes to fire. That's, That's the double one, isn't it? It does double. This goes to... This is big. Oh boy. Uh, so this is nine, so this goes to 18. Um, Jesus. Oh crap. Uh, it doesn't have trample though, right? No, but you can give it... Death touch. You can give it death touch. I don't have any green. Oh, I do have green. To, to be fair, I think it's going to be powerful enough that it doesn't need death touch. Yeah. Plus when he attacks, he taps his lands. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. 18. It's still got that on. Oh my god. Yeah. Then I'm going to have a look at the graveyard. You don't need to attack, it's fine. <laughs> <laughs> um, 10, 12. Uh oh. It's not, I'm just, I'm just working, I'm just working out. Six. Turn and then I'll have, then I'll have two, two, three, four. Okay, uh, I'll pay six for my commander. Mm -hmm. So I've got uh, I've got six left over. Um, I will let it pay on one and a half. Oh, damn it. <laughs> it's always the case. It's always the case. Uh, we're going to Yeah. Currently all I have up is a trading post staffed by a golem. Who's probably bigger than the trading post, to be fair. No, but he is the trading post. He's got like loads of little like little trading boobs on his that, that, that that'll work. Uh, I'm going to play a Archimancer Arche and I'm going to return the draw three. Yep. Oh, I could so return to fairies as well. Um, I'll probably be a little bit better. It'll be two less mana. Yeah. Return to, uh, to fairies gambit. Tetherite's gambit, in fact. Um, which gives me no, that. Yeah, that's good. That means I can use the final two mana because six. 10, yep. two, three, sorry, I did three awkwardly. That's right. Uh, I'll pay two life, I get 17. Seventeen. Uh, I will draw two cards and I'll proliferate twice. Jesus. <laughs> Got some big kings. I don't know if I played all well on this turn. Uh, so this will go. I'll leave that on town. It's easy to read. Two. This goes to 20. <sighs> so glad that doesn't have trample right now. Mm. Yeah, I can't. I can't unfortunately. I He's blue. <laughs> I cannot give it trample. Um, so this can attack. You can't attack. You can just sit over here for a while. Um, 
Okay. Sorry, I'm just thinking. Uh, go to combat. Uh, we will attack you. Yep. For 20. 24. 20, 24. Um, you can just regenerate, right? Yep. One. Uh, so we have one man open. If I do that, then you can attack him, which is pretty good. So I think I will still do that. Um, attack you for 24. Yep. Any other attacks? Uh, the only thing can attack is my mind flare, and it doesn't win with that, so no. Okay. Yeah, I'll block with the elf and then regenerate it. I'll untap my land. Main phase two. Is it I think I just pass. Yep. Yeah. I will. Pass it Okay. Is it when you when you just attack, or is it when you hit someone? When I attack. Uh, it looks rude. Okay. Ooh, that's good. That could be very good. But what do we have here? So, how many creatures do you have to block with One, how two, powerful three, are they all? This is a... Three, 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 three five. This can become indestructible. Oh, okay. Uh, this is a... Three, three, so these both are three, three. And you're... So one, two. One, two. Hmm. Okay, so I think... If I did that and attacked you, we would probably trade, although... Mm -hmm. Might be better off casting Kozilek right now. Because I don't think I could get through your blockers. Um, I'm not too worried about this board state at the moment, no offense. <laughs> <laughs> I totally get it. I'm not doing much. Um, and being able to counterspell things that you come up with might be more useful than just getting rid of a few of your blockers. Mm, makes sense to me. Can't so, like making an appearance. Let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, seven to untap. 10, um... How many cards do you want? Me? Or no, you. Four. Okay, cool. Um... So I'll draw three as well, so pretty good. Yeah, I think... I think might, uh... Might give Kozilek an appearance, so... Let's... Tap one, tap this, untap... Basalt Monolith. Tap Basalt Monolith for three. Four. Um... Five, six. Seven, eight, uh, nine, ten. And we will get Kozilek onto the field. Big guy. Very nice. Yep. So, so you can discard cards with the same converted mana cost to, yep, to counter, counter spells. Counter right. spells. Yep. Draw up to seven. Oh, wow. Yeah, you can draw up Look, fill that hand. Oh, I could use one of that. I could use one of that. <laughs> I can also use one of that. <laughs> you could also swing with it by equipping your creeps. Yeah, just put those booties on him and go to town. I could do, to be fair. I mean... It's got menace, I can't block it. Uh, I, I can. You can. Yes, but would you be? You wouldn't have enough power to kill Kozilek, though. So I'd be able mm. to get rid of some of your blockers. You'd be able to get rid of one. Still, so I'll make this into three, oh, and then block with probably. But then, wouldn't I be able to choose where the damage went? Yeah. If I was... okay, okay. Yeah. So you 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 kill one of my creatures. Yeah, because you'd block with that and another one, and yeah, got gotcha. you. Um, is it worth tapping him for that? Sorry, how much life are you still at? Not sure. Still on 40. Still on 40. No one's hit me. Still still hit, hit, hit him. <laughs> <laughs> Can I get your uh, Johnson's off there? 18. Um, Zero. 
I mean, I will put the Greaves on Coslet regardless. You're technically on 10, you just died of infect. Oh, yeah. Um, <laughs> put a little dash through that so it's an infect counter. Yeah, you don't get like it. Okay. Um, I'll be quiet now. You don't have to be quiet. I see. <laughs> so now I need, I need to leave something blocking with that around. Um, what do you mean, this, this 24, 24? Yeah, you can't block the 24, 24 if it's coming at you. I need, I need trample. You got anything with trample? I can... <laughs> yeah, I got plenty of things with trample. <laughs> They're all either in my hand or in my hand. <laughs> Nothing in my hand. Um, okay. I am going to... It's pretty cool. Didn't do much though. Mm-hmm. A minute. Yeah. No, not at all. No. To swing at you with Kozilek and Oblivion Sower. Me? Yep. Okay. Uh, free mana, indestructible counter. Yep. Uh, then. Do you have to remove counter or some Teku at all to do that? Oh, yeah. Sorry. Yeah, you're right. I, I just paid the mana. Uh, you have to remove free counters from creatures or um, artifacts or. Planeswalkers. Yeah. Uh, so I'll remove three of these. Yep. Okay, you guys 17, sorry. Works for me. Still pretty big. <laughs> um, when then block... Tegithal gets the instructable counter. I'm gonna block... Yeah, right, cool. I'm gonna block... He's attacking me? Yeah. He's got menace. Mm-hmm. Double block... Yeah, double block him with my commander yep. and the deep, deep blue escape. Okay. I think I take five here. <laughs> I think that's fine. Okay. Take five. Um, I guess twelve. I'm assuming you're going to kill the deep blue escape. Uh, yes. Yeah, it will. Yeah, it will die. Twelve. 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 Um. And yes, I will. Uh, I will pass there. See if uh, see if an elf resurgence happens. Oh. So forest. <laughs> forest actually. Isn't there a card for that? Like leave crown visionary. Other elves get plus one plus one whenever you cast an elf spell. Like pay a green mana, I do a drop card. The game big. That's, that's that's really good, right? Yeah, I mean, good. you need you need another, another elf. elf. <laughs> <laughs> another elf. But that's that's a good next elf. rotation. Not, <laughs> not a bad draw. Depends if I draw another elf. I mean, you could just let Azuri die at some point. And... Yeah, the problem with Azuri just like, you can't, it's it's so hard to get through to him. Mm-hmm. Actually, it makes more sense. If I think about it. Pay the four mana to, to, to tap Castle Garenberg for six. Use two of that to cast this. So you got four left in? So I got four left over, then I can pay, pay another five. five to activate Azuri. Yeah. What does it, that Elf do? creatures get plus three plus three and trample to enter. Oh, okay, cool. And they're also getting plus one from the Leaf Crown Visionary, and I'm going to ascend <laughs> both of them at yourself. <laughs> uh, can you time the staff? Yeah, so Azuri is five, six, and the this elf is a three, four, five. So a five and a six. With a trample. six, six, and a five, five. With trample, yeah. With trample. Um, okay. You're a three, five, um, and a one, two. I'm not giving you that back. <laughs> <laughs> However much. Um, nice try. Annoyingly, I can't kill. Uh, you could regenerate anyway, right? I don't have no mana left. Oh, okay. Uh, okay, I will block the... It doesn't matter. I will take six damage. Block the five, five, take six. Oh no, it's better the other way around because he's commander. I'll yeah. block your commander, take one commander damage, five from the other guy. Okay, so like six in total. I go to six. Don't After that, that, I'm done. Pass turn. Cool. I will untap. Um, Cause like doesn't have to be 
untapped for me to be able to do that. Yeah, you do whatever. Yeah, it's fine. Yeah. You have a full hand of seven, right? I do indeed. I'll Which means a full hand of counter spells. I didn't draw. Yeah. I didn't draw. No. Draw. On top you do. Okay. Oh, right, yeah. They're important. You can leave him down, though. Yeah, you can leave him. He's fine. <laughs> yeah, I need him. <laughs> <laughs> I need him to punch. <laughs> Um, okay. Uh, kill his mind flare. I'll get my elf back if I can hit him with it. <laughs> yes, but you could also hit me with No, I would, I would never. No, you would then. <laughs> <laughs> no, can you right. regenerate this elf? I have no mana. You have no mana. The point is I need to deal with you really now. At this point. I, I want to give this trample so bad. <laughs> <laughs> You're mono blue, you can't. You're not allowed. Um, mono blue trump? Ooh, these words aren't, aren't coming out of my much, mouth properly. Sorry, how much life is that? He's on 18. Oh, I just that 18. Yeah. 18. So this does kill you. Are you tapped out? He has a blocker. Have, he has a blocker. I have one mana and a blocker. You can make a goat. Oh, can you? Yes, I can make a goat. Yeah. So you can make a blocker. Mm-hmm. So attacking you is useless. Um, um, un- unless you particularly enjoy killing goats. Yeah, exactly, but it would be better to hold it up. And... Okay, uh, one, two, three, four, five. Uh, I'll play Will Kenrith, who is yeah. a total of six mana. Uh, can I have a read of Will? Until your next turn to... Ki- oh, I uh, don't like the look of that. Instant sorcery. This is the partner one. Yes. Um, you can elect to search. Sorry? You can elect to search. Does it have to resolve for him to elect to search? Yes. Then I can answer that question. No, he is. Um, oh, wait, wait, wait. No, I'm, 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 I'm not playing red. But yeah, I, no, I, he's I, not I, red. I, oh, yes. oh, I forgot. You can, Sorry. You, you, you can still red. use the ability. But I mean, I can, I can shuffle my deck if I want. But yes, yeah. I'm, go- I'm going to use Kozilek's ability, match the CMC counter, spell it. Yep, you got a six. He's got a six. Cool. Very nice. Uh, we will tap. Mm. We'll tap 12. <laughs> that could be <laughs> Oh my god. Man. I feel like I wasn't doing as much of a ridiculous 12. thing as. But 12, you have way more than 12. You yeah, have way, but... way more. Uh, I'm going to cast. Um, Vile duplication. I'm not going to try and pronounce the first word. May I have a look? Herenicus. Uh, create a token that's a copy of Turbi. Oh, oh dear. Uh, counter, it. counter it. Can you counter it? Counter spell. You got a four? <laughs> nice. Okay. Oh, that, 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 that's a bit. Wait, that's, that's your creature. That's your, that's your occupancy. Sorry. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. You probably would have made a card like. <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't know. Actually, it, it counted shroud. It has to be, it has it has to be my, 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 my oh, creature. Okay. Well, then oh, I would have taken a stolen flare. He would have stolen the cosmos. No, yeah, that's right. Taking an oblivion so probably. Um, I would have. Yeah, I would You'll have never know. Yeah, you'll we'll never know. <laughs> um, cool. Land. Pass. The classic. Land I'm, I'm, I've got one card left. So I'm uh, not not exactly yeah. counted out there. Not, yeah, I'm not exactly in a hot spot. Okay. In terms of cards, at least. Um, hmm. Let's see. Um, that's the. That's on ETB, so that's it's already ETB. done. It's shenanigans but still so you've got six life can i actually get through so fully enough if you do destroy his mind flare 
He loses the Mind Flare and he loses the Elvish Warmaster, which means he's down to two blockers. Yes, but that also means you will then be on 40 life with... True. But I'm, I'm, just, I'm, 20, I'm just giving you solutions. That, ha- well, that will have Death Touch and Trample, yeah. by the way. <laughs> well, if I can afford it. Yeah, Which no, I, I, d- I don't like the idea okay. of you getting that back. So I think we might shift our focus over here. <laughs> just for, a, just, <laughs> just, for, a, just um, for a few life, you know. Um, so that's a one. It's a one one. That's all I got. Okay. No man, don't count generate. Well, you've got Menace, so you could you could put him down some life because just a little bit. We can't. We can't. We can't you can yeah. smack me with the cards like it'll be the first damage I take. Yeah, these life totals are in orders of scale: six, eighteen, forty. Yes. Um, no, well, 6, 18, 40, dead. Uh, thanks for reminding me. I'm, 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 yeah. I feel like I'm here in spirit. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, <coughs> eight, <coughs> nine, ten, <coughs> eleven. Oh, oh, Jesus. For a Pathraiser of Ulmog. Oh, that's the. Which one is that one? Um, can't be blocked except by three or more creatures. It's a 9-9 nine, nine with a Nihilator 3. Right. Oh my god. Right. Mega Menace. Okay. okay. Um, but yeah, if basically, if I'm attacking you to the point where he's getting the big elf back, he needs to be... Well, to be honest, if you... if you So you could switch over the Greaves to the path. I'm, I'm planning to. He's going to sack the elf to the, to the Nihilator trigger. Because he's not going to want me to have it. Uh, to be honest, though, if if I'm if I'm going to kill him, you might just do it out of yeah, spite. Yeah, I might, might just give it to you back anyway, and then you That's can true. kill him. Um, we true. don't act in spite in these. Oh uh, yeah, yeah, I do. <laughs> <laughs> if I... um, so let's alternatively, see. you can just annihilate me. <laughs> Um, <laughs> plus, this this is open to block as it stands. Also, by the way, just just to remind you, if you kill him. This he goes is. away. Ooh. That is also true. Oh, that is do also true. And then I'm just a little guy on six. Just a um, little, so little need, guy with a little island. I need a locker for that. <laughs> uh, how much damage can you do besides that? You can do seven. <laughs> not not much. Okay. Not much. Um, I am going to swing these two creatures at you. Okay. Annihilator 3. Yep. Um, coming in for 21. Oh, Kozilek has Menace. This has... I will sacrifice my commander, the Greaves, and this elf. I will take... <coughs> 21. 21 damage. Ooh! Good he, God. He, he's, he's, he's not alive. He's mortal. <laughs> he's mortal. <laughs> 19. 19. Is it the first time you've taken damage? The yeah. first time I've taken damage. Yeah. <sighs> the elves are mortal. One no. more hit from Kozilek and I die. Oh, oh of course, it's Commander. Damn. Oh, yes. He's 12, so he has two hits. <laughs> you did, have I been hit by that? No. Okay, cool. Uh, I've just been countered by it. Um, so, yes, I don't have any mana left for... May I read this? Anything else? Go for it. Um, and I will pass there. That's one that I never had. Drop. Yeah, yeah, we got that. I've got that. Oh, you never let me, let me have it for my day. It's pretty annoying. <laughs> yeah. For good reason. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I'm just OCD about how I lay my cards out. Oh, yeah, it's fine. All right, uh, you, you do you. I will cast Creeping Renaissance. Choose a permanent type. Return all card chosen type from the griever to your hand. Oh, I will creatures. choose it. Elf. Oh. oh. Griever, yeah, it makes sense. Creature. Yeah, humans as well. Yeah, you get all back. <laughs> they all go to my hand, and I only have one mana. So you sure you don't want to choose zombies? <laughs> I'm not going to be casting anything anytime soon. I choose vampires. Up here. That's fine. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so these go to my hand. I don't have a one mana guy, so I'll pass. And okay. I will probably die because yeah. now I have cards in my hand. I, I mean, I need to draw something. I'll tell you that now. Um, I, need I mean, to. I'll just die to the cosmic. Like, I can't block them. Yeah. I, think I, I, I love how I seem to kind of walk the fine line this game of sort of not, not being the, 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 the one obvious target until yeah. right near the end. The second most threatening until you are the most threatening. <laughs> yeah. It's always been someone else that needed to be the priority target. Yeah. Is there any way I could draw a card? No. 
No, 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 no. I need it. I really, I really, really needed to not have just islands on my deck. <laughs> so I could do some, like, sack them and draw cards. Um, okay. I <laughs> reckon you just swing. Just swing. <laughs> this isn't looking good. Uh, playing islands. Your elf is bigger than the Pathraiser. We can't just smack him. See so what happens. And he's on low enough life that he'll uh, the Sorry, this no, th this one's tapped. Sorry, I, I, oh, fair enough. Because I, I got it back oh, after. after it, yeah, 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 and I, I forgot to put it to tap it again. That was my bad. Um, I, was, I was thinking, does this give all elves trample? If you're a little creature, you control. Yeah, like, if it's still on your board, then maybe we could uh, <laughs> make a deal, but. Uh, yeah, I got absolutely Yeah, I, have, I just have nothing. an Oblivion Sower and a Golem with various trinkets and probably goats slung all over him. How many cards in hand now? Five. Five, yeah. Uh, yeah, I got nothing. I'll pass. I think Jonathan might have the game. Okay. I really needed that Invictus to, to resolve so I could get my troll spell back. That's what I wanted. Mm -hmm. oh, so, I wanted. remind me, the indestructible, what happens to an indestructible creature if you reduce it to zero life? That dies. Dead. Okay. So it's like, it can still die, it just can't be destroyed. Yeah. I mean, well, if, if, no, if, it's if, it's, yeah, I'll let you explain. Yeah, it would have to be like a negative, it's like Black Song Zenith would kill it because it gives it negative, negative X, negative X. But if you just do damage to it, and it reduces the power, the toughness to zero, it doesn't die. Okay. So damage and destroy doesn't destroy it. Okay. But reducing its life without dealing damage. That would kill it. Does, okay. So when mind flare and yeah. I don't want to kill that because. To be honest, you have me dead to cosmic anyway. Yeah. And um, when I die, that goes away anyway. Yeah, yeah. That's, that, that's my objective really for this turn. It's just, uh, if I can do anything else as well. Um, you better keep lots of cards in your hands. The cards shattering your. <laughs> you better keep better keep lots of cards. I got um, I got I got a lot to do. <laughs> okay. Um, I am going to two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, seven, ten. Nice. Um, to put in a spawn sire of Ulamog. Great card. Um, mm. and I am to beat the Eldrazi player up sooner. Problem is, I can't swing at you this turn because he wouldn't be dead yet. So you'd just block with a um. Yes, I would get my, I would be able to throw your creature. Yeah. Um so let's um yeah, let's go to combat. So attacking me with Kozilek. Yep. Uh, he's got minus so I can't block, so I shall buy to commander damage. I mean for what it's worth, it's nothing personal, it's just to get rid of this. That's fair. <laughs> that is fair. Thank you. The elves go back to the forest. And I will pass there. I uh, will tap an island to Mythical Tutor. Okay. Do you have a one mana spell? Um, regrettably, I do not. Okay. What mana do we think he's got? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I have five cards in hand. Mystical is a it's in sorcery, right? Uh, yes, that's right. Instant interrupt the mana source or sorcery card. It's instant sorcery. Sorry. You need to reveal that card to all players. Yep. Even the dead ones. Yeah, even the dead ones. Yeah, even the even dead, the dead ones. ones. Show me first, okay? <laughs> it's not how that okay. <laughs> how this works. <laughs> um, uh, I'm gonna uh, target Ghost Sleep Flicker. Yep. Sure. So two target artifacts, creatures, and all. Troll, then return them. Okay. 
So he's gonna flicker my flare at probably the Archaea Monster. Mm. It is on top of my deck. Okay. 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 So if you have a three mana card, then I, I'm probably done. Uh, I will tap. <laughs> it <is>. doesn't <laughs> look like he does. Draw. That, that, that tells me it does. <laughs> that tells me the exact opposite. <laughs> um, just don't play it, just you know, accept fate. Tap three. Uh, I guess three. Okay. Um, Count spell. GG. Uh, nothing else I can do. Uh, you kill me next time. <laughs> Most likely. Well, you got three blockers. You can still Just block. Three blockers. I can't because yeah. this can't needs be three by blocks. Except three or more creatures. And this has got menace, Ooh. so I'm dead. So, yeah, I think. Uh, Play it out. Yeah. Go for it. Oh, did you, did, that question. Did you have a four? Uh, no. Damn it. <laughs> and there's a card that does it for four. I believe you can still win this one. I reckon there's a chance. No, there's literally not. I've got no, 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 there's definitely a chance. <laughs> what are you talking about with no cards? Um, okay. Um, Victory lap. I will just, uh, just to be super safe here. One, two, three, four, five. For a Dark Steel Juggernaut. Yeah. I will give it Haste and Shroud. And its power and toughness are currently equal to the number of one, two, three, four, five, six. So it's a seven, seven at present. Mm -hmm. um, I will, um, yeah, go to combat and I will swing at you with um, four Eldrazi, a Golem, and a Juggernaut. I declare no blockers. Okay, in response to you declaring no blockers, I tap Mind Stone, pay one life, make a goat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Good game. GG's.